last time on the battle between Mario and Frank the Zombie. Frank had sent out um, Salam all his Pokemon, but had only had two knocked out, Salamance and the Servine. But all his Pokemon have been tired out and shown. And, but while Mario has had three, three of his Pokemon down, but only one of the last three that he has shown. What will be the outcome? What Mario is choosing first? What will his first Pokemon be? What will Frank's counter be? Find out in part two of the ba of the battles. Welcome back to the battles. Today we are here with the champ with the championship match between ch champion Mario and the challenger Frank. So so let's go, Mario. You will make the first choice. All right, let's go. Pinsar! Pinsar! And Mario's fifth Pokemon is a Pinsar. Alright, let's go, Blaze again! Boy. And it looks like Frank is calling out his Blaze again once more. Blaze again, let's start out strong! Blaze kick! Ugh, Pinsar. I was expecting you to choose Blaziken. Now, Pinsir, use Rock Throw. Pinsir! Uh, nah. Unfortunately, <laughs> folks, that's not super effective because of Blaziken's half type. Or dual type, I mean. That's right! He's also a fighting type. Oh, uh, and. But luckily, he. Pinsir resists fighting type moves. Yo, Blaze again. Close combat. That's exactly what I was going for. And a surprise move by Blaziken on a, a fighting type move which Pinsir resists. Now that your defenses are lowered, Pinsir, use X Scissor. Pinsir! Blaziken. Blaziken returns. He uh, switched out his Blaziken. Uh, what to choose? What to choose? Let's go! Needle Queen! Hit all! A poison ground type. The Needle Queen is back. Alright, Needle Queen, let's shake things off. Mock Punch! You can counter something. And Pinsir grabbed Needle Queen's hand. Pinsir seismic toss. Uh. <clears throat> Pinsir is on fire. Needle Queen earthquake. Pinsir. Uh. Pinsir dig. Now to finish this off, you use a move at the same time. Needle Queen, superpower. Dig. <laughs> it's a double elimination with the powerful moves of Dig and Superpower. Needle Queen and Pins are both unable to battle. Rat. Uh, let's see. Alakazam and Metagross were my only two counters against Blaziken. So what do I have to, what can I do now? Hmm. And now for the next Pokemon. <laughs> let's go! Blastoise! Oh, this one I can deal with! Venusaur, come back out! Venusaur! And we see the return of his blaze or uh, Venusaur. And of course, the only move you know that of Venusaur's is Sleep Powder. Blastoise! I still have three more moves up my sleeve. <laughs> Blastoise, Hydro Cannon to the ground! What and, the? And Bla Blastoise has used his hydro cannon to plummet up to the sky. Venusaur, sunny day. Venusaur. 
Blast. Uh, blast. blast Joyce must be getting really hot up there. Blast Joyce. <laughs> <laughs> and that wasn't just to bring Blast Joyce down. Venusaur Solar Beam! <laughs> Blast Joyce is unable to battle. Venusaur wins. <laughs> Is now down two Pokemon each. And I will and Blaziken's on the line. <clears throat> Alright, let's go. Dust Claws. Dust Claws. What to do? What to do? Hmm. I know. Venusaur! Return! I now will be able to see Mario's last Pokemon. Sceptile! Let's go! Sceptile! And now we see Mario's famed starter Pokemon. Well, second at least. Dust Claps. Fisher. Ah! Oh, it missed. Snapped. It was close, though. Fissure, if it hits, is a one-hit KO move. I see why would you, why you would use it in this case. But no matter. Septile Shadow Ball. Uh, does clobs spite? Uh, Septile can no longer use Shadow Ball. <laughs> Uh, then I'll use. Uh, Dust clubs while it's distracted. Shadow ball. Solar beam. <laughs> and Dust clubs makes a clean hit on Septile, but he keeps on charging. <laughs> Dust clubs into the shadows. <laughs> now. What? Nah. Dust clubs. <laughs> Now for the ultimate move, Frenzy Plant. Sip. Not dust clubs into the shadows now. I mean, it, wait, this. We wait where dust clubs will appear. Now, Fisher. Sip. Sip. Fisher hits because it's way underground. Dust Claps! Sceptile is unable to battle! Dust Claps wins! Now, Dust Claps returns! Mario's last Pokemon is Venusaur! <laughs> Venusaur! Poison Powder! <laughs> That's right! My Venusaur has Sleep Powder, Poison Powder, Solar Beam and Sunny Day. Blaze again. Just one clean hit is all we need. Overheat. <laughs> Peter Store hangs on. What? And the poison overdoes Blaze again. Blaze again is now unable to battle. Venusaur Store wins. Way to go, Venusaur. Now we just need to take down that blasted dust clump. Dust clump. And with the final match, we will now be changing fields once more. This is it, Venusaur. Just a few clean hits and you'll will defeat that blasted dust class. Venusaur. And folks, it looks like now our battlefield is a clear, normal place. Slay it. With no boundaries whatsoever. Alright. Let's start things off with an interesting move. Sleep powder! Does class. Now! Sunny day! Dust clubs. Dust clubs! Oh no! The sun must have woken up dust clubs! Dust clubs! No matter! Hypno Solar beam! Hypnosis! Oh no! Venusaur! <laughs> Fisher! Shadow Ball! 
Vino. Dos. Venusaur. Now, you solar beam once more. Dos. Um, Dustclops is very barely hanging on. Now, final attack. Dark Void. Venusaur is now asleep with a poison kind of status. Now, Dream Eater. Dustclops gains some health back. Now, Shadow Ball. Both Pokemon are at their breaking edge. Shadow Ball! Solar Beam! And Mario is the winner! We're through. Thanks a lot. You guys did great. Good job, Venusaur. Well, Mario, looks like you're still the champion. Yep. Thanks for an awesome battle. You too. And next time, who will be against the champion Mario? We'll find out in the next episode of The Battles.